Hi everyone, it's me. In today's video, we are going to eat and work out like Bella Hadid. <laughs> I don't think I've ever done a video like this, but I just felt inspired this week after seeing like so many clips on social media of Bella Hadid getting that like spray on dress. <laughs> <laughs> like painted on her during Paris Fashion Week. I don't know. I feel like Bella is just trending everywhere and I got curious to try her diet and her workout routine. That's what today's video is going to be about. I did do a little bit of research and got some information from different sites that were pretty like similar in their information so I feel like the information I have must be accurate. But yeah, that's gonna be today. We're gonna live like Bella Hadid kind of <laughs> but probably like the not as rich kind of bootleg version <laughs> and yeah so this morning before breakfast we are going to get a little bit of movement in i read that bella exercises for two hours a day and that's a lot for a normal person <laughs> i feel like a normal person doesn't need that much but she does do a couple different workout styles so i'm just gonna do a couple of different workouts and like maybe hopefully it'll add up to around two hours so in bella's workout routine she says she likes to do a stretch every morning that's how she likes to start the day but she doesn't really like yoga because yoga is like it seems too slow for her and it's kind of boring she likes to like get up and at them with quicker movement so I'm gonna start the morning with maybe like a quick non-yoga like stretch <laughs> and then throughout the day I'm going to do a kickboxing because Bella really likes to do any form of boxing practice and the third type of movement I'm going to do today is Pilates because that is also something that Bella has said that she likes to do so yeah three forms of movement today we're gonna stretch we're gonna do kickboxing and we're gonna do Pilates maybe not all at once maybe a little more spread throughout the day but that's the plan first things first I'm gonna do a stretch and then I think we're gonna have some breakfast. How come the stars come to shine when it's dark? From so far away, show us where we are. What makes the sun go to sleep every night? And what's it dreaming of? You guys, I lied to you. <laughs> so I just did that little stretch. The way I found that video was I searched quick stretch and that's like the first video that popped up. So it was about like an eight minute stretch. It passed by super quick and I didn't get bored. So I hope Bella wouldn't either. <laughs> but I'm kind of like pumped now when I want to work out. So I'm going to do a kickboxing workout before I have breakfast. And the video I have decided to do for kickboxing is the Caroline Bourbon kickboxing workout. It's so much fun. This was part of her Epic Endgame program. So I have done this workout like two times before, I think, but I'm going to do that one today. And then we will have breakfast after this kickboxing workout. I promise. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Everything that we've been through has made us strong You won't believe we've had our way But somewhere there's a light inside of us It shows the way Not looking for no, no, no We are in the kitchen. That kickboxing workout was so much fun, but we are going to have a breakfast now. So Bella's go-to breakfast apparently is sausage and eggs. So I have these maple breakfast sausages that I'm going to make this morning along with some eggs. Maybe I'll have something else on the side that she also likes, but we'll see. <laughs> So a Bella breakfast consists of eggs and sausage. I also decided to have some skewer, which is like an Icelandic style yogurt, similar to Greek yogurt. It's really thick and raspberries because Bella did mention she likes skewer and berries as a snack. So I just decided to incorporate it into breakfast today. And I am having greens because Bella has said that she enjoys her green juice. I haven't had skewer in a long time, actually. I'm very excited to have this. It's so thick. 
You don't really like scare though, do you? Do you think the cats get confused when you talk to yourself? <laughs> I think they get confused at a lot of things, like why we wear clothes. Why do we wear clothes? Cats don't wear clothes. <laughs> and they get confused when I work out. They're like, uh. <laughs> they like when I stretch or do yoga, but they get very confused when I'm like jumping around and like doing stuff. They jump around too. They run around, don't really jump on the spot. <laughs> when you jump on the spot, they're like, what's the point of that? This is like quite a good breakfast, I think. It's quite balanced. I feel like this will fill me up. There you go. Bella breakfast. Impressed so far. Guys. <laughs> That's how fiance wanted me to start the clip. Didn't ya? <laughs> what a sassy face. <laughs> Every time I'm like about to turn my camera, fiance is like, guys. <laughs> I just went out for a little bit of a stroll. I didn't walk that much, but I'm hoping that that can count towards a little bit of my two hours of exercise that I'm supposed to do today. <laughs> but we have worked up a little bit of an appetite, so we are going to have a Bella Hadid themed lunch today. What better thing to make than her sandwich that is currently trending all over TikTok. So if you're not on TikTok, Bella posted a TikTok of herself making a sandwich. She was having like some sort of a picnic, but yeah, she made a sandwich and that sandwich is now going viral known as the Bella Hadid sandwich. So definitely had to make that for lunch. It looks pretty simple, but yeah, I'll show you guys how I make it. First, we start with a whole baguette. Are you guys ready for this monster of a sandwich? I don't know why I'm having so much fun with this. Yeah. Here is the sandwich. This thing is massive. Look at it beside my head. <laughs> and this is half of it, obviously. Let's give it a taste. Mmm, it's pretty good. I was thinking maybe it's not like saucy enough. It looks kind of dry, but the brie kind of acts as its own sauce. I would say it's missing like a little bit of crunch. It needs like something crunchy, like a pickle. Mm. It needs a pickle and then it would be like great. But it's really good. Bella sandwich. <laughs> Approved. I'm also having some celery with peanut butter. Bella says she likes having celery with like almond butter or cashew butter, so I did my best. I'm not made out of money here, you guys. So I'm just using plain old regular peanut butter and I hope that's okay. She says she likes this combination as a snack, so I decided to combine it with the sandwich for lunch. And there we go, a Bella themed lunch. <laughs> copyright off my channel. I'm having a little espresso. Apparently Bella loves her espresso and she usually has like at least three before lunch, which is slightly concerning. And I do realize it's past lunch, so I've already failed that part already. But I'm having my espresso now. This is decaf because I'm sensitive <laughs> to caffeine, but it's the best I can do. Cheers. Whew. I have to do Pilates soon. In total, now with the Pilates, I must have worked out for at least an hour and a half because I did the stretch this morning. I did the, what did I do? I did the kickboxing. I went out on a little tiny mini walk and then I did Pilates. So I'm gonna say we did an hour and a half of movement today and I think 
that's good enough for me. <laughs> so workout portion of today is done. I think that's a really good combo, like stretching obviously, super healthy for your body, good for your mobility. So I always support stretching. Kickboxing is one of my favorite ways to do cardio. So I obviously support that as well. And then Pilates is just great for strength, control, conditioning, and also mobility as well. So yeah. Good day of movement today. I think the last thing we have to do today is dinner. So I will see you guys when it's dinner time. All right, you guys, and our final meal inspired by Bella Hadid is pizza. <laughs> so Bella has said many times that she doesn't restrict foods, which I think is a really good message that she spreads. And she says she really enjoys her pizza. She also mentioned that she really likes having greens at dinner and especially kale. So I got a pizza that has kale on it <laughs> just to stay true to Bella. That's dinner. <laughs> Watch this. This is how I eat my pizza. You see that? No, baby! <laughs> no, baby, that's too much bread to filling ratio. That's dinner. All right, guys, I think I'm going to end today's video here. It's getting dark. I'm just gonna do, I don't know, cozy evening things <laughs> for the rest of the night. But I hope you liked this one. I'm actually very impressed. I know that like what I ate today and how I exercised probably isn't like exactly what Bella does, but it was definitely inspired. And I thoroughly enjoyed every single meal, every single workout. It was a little bit excessive in terms of the working out. I I wouldn't recommend working out two hours a day for everyone just because first of all like who has two hours a day to work out but knowing that like staying in shape and all that is literally part of Bella's job it makes sense that you know she's able to work out for that many hours every day and obviously with a trainer who's gonna guide her in the right direction and make sure she's doing everything in a healthy way in terms of the food today I mean I feel really full <laughs> I feel like I ate a decent amount today and I'm feeling good in terms of food. I learned a new sandwich recipe today, which is exciting. And yeah, again, I appreciate that Bella Hadid makes sure that she puts out the message there, like eat if you want to eat, don't restrict yourself. I think there's literally a quote from her saying something like, if you want to eat the bread, eat the bread. And coming from her as someone who is a model and someone that a lot of young girls probably look up to, I think, yeah, it's important for figures like her to make sure they're sending the right message across. So really appreciate that. But yeah, I had so much fun today again. So if this is a video that you liked watching, because I know it's kind of a new format on my channel, let me know in the comments and also let me know who you would like to see me eat and work out like next. And maybe I can make this sort of another series. If you did like this video, please give me a like and a comment. If you don't know what to comment down below, leave me a comment that says, if you want the bread, eat the bread. <laughs> if you like me, subscribe, do that bell thing, and I will see you in the next one.